Hello viewers, this is IT System Admin, a complete troubleshooting solution for you. Today, in this tutorial, I am going to show you how to fix system interrupts high CPU uses in Windows 10 computers. System interrupts appears as a Windows process in your task manager, but it's not really a process. Interrupts are a form of communication of software and hardware with the CPU. On a healthy system, system interrupts will cover between 0.1 and 2% of CPU uses. Even peaks of 3% to 7% can be considerable within the normal range. If system interrupts constantly hogs more than 5% to 10% of your CPU, something is wrong and you are most likely dealing with a hardware issue. Okay, now I am going to show you how to fix system interrupts high CPU uses in Windows 10 computer. Okay, right click on Start menu. Click on Device Manager. Log in Network Adapter. I am using Realtalk Wireless LAN USB 2 Network Adapter. Okay, right click on it and click on properties and then click on power management and deselect the allow the device allow this device to work the computer. Just deselect it and click OK. Now go to USB serial bus controller, expand it. This is USB root hub. Okay, uh, you will delete all root hubs except USB keyboard and USB mouse. Remember it, you have to delete all root hubs except the root hub for USB keyboard and mouse. Okay, how can you check it? Go to and go to events. You will find your uh, USB root hub description here, and then you have to delete all root hubs. Okay, now close device manager. Now insert type cmd right click on command prompt and click on run as administrator in command prompt just type csk dsk space slash r okay just hit enter look the message checked the next time the system restarts uh, type y for yes and hit enter now close command prompt now click on start menu click on power and click on restart your computer disk scanning and repairing is going on
now logging on the computer after restarting your computer hope your problem has been solved this is all for today hope this tutorial is helpful for you keep watching for next tutorial thank you very much